In this video, we are going to prove that the integration of this one is equal to this. And we shall do that by trigonometric substitution. We have to choose a trigonometric function for x so that we can get rid of the square root. If we choose x squared to be second theta, then we can get rid of the square root. Differentiate this one with respect to x, we have 2x dx equal to second theta tan theta d theta, which implies dx is equal to second theta tan theta d theta divided by 2x. Note that we have to express x in term of theta. Second theta tan theta d theta divided by 2. What is x from here? Square root. Square root second theta. Therefore, integral i becomes in place of dx we have second theta tan theta d theta divided by 2 root over second theta divided by in place of x we have square root second theta root over here we have x square to the power 2 now in place of x square we have second theta second theta with this square we have second square theta second square theta minus 1 so it implies i is equal to integration second theta tan theta d theta divided by this one comes to the denominator 2 square root second theta square root second theta and here we know that 1 plus tan square theta is equal to second square theta so this implies second square theta minus 1 is equal to tan square theta in place of second square theta minus 1 we have tan square theta i is equal to integration from here square root second theta times square root second theta we have second theta square root with the square get cancelled so we have tan theta cancel cancelled then we have i to be half integration d theta integration d theta is theta lastly we have to express theta in term of x from the beginning we have let x square to be second theta so from here what does it imply it implies that second theta is equal to second inverse x square so in place of theta we have second inverse x square hence proved